I think it's a law. I'm not really sure, but I think it's a law. It's it's a con- constitution, right? Um, I'm not sure, but alam ko parang ano yun eh, parang pledge ba yun? I think it's just something complicated. No. Um, no. Um, no. No. Uh, yes. No. No. Um, no. 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 Yes. No. Um, yes, I do. Hindi ko na siya memorize as much as before. No. For me, no. Yes. No. No. <laughs> Nalilinig ko ba't hindi ko siya alam fully? Uh, yes, I have uh, quite a background in uh, what the preamble of our constitution says. No. I don't have an in-depth understanding of... I don't know, that's it. I'm familiar with it. Pero yung buo, hindi ko alam. Yes. Um, yes, I do. But I have limited knowledge about it. Yes, I have an idea of what the 1987 Constitution is. Yes, I know it. Um, I remember that it's like a pledge. And we studied it last time, but I forgot it right now. I just know that it's a constitution. Um, alam ko lang na may connection sa law. Yes. So, for the preamble is, as I mentioned, the start or the beginning of the constitution, which is the, the Bible uh, the, of the law of the land. Um, it states there the ideas or rather more of what or how the Filipino as an individual or as a nation should act to protect the liberty and freedom of the nation, of the country. Uh, kapag kasi constitution, um, yun yung rules na dapat i-follow and yun yung magiging guiding principle, guiding principle sa mga decisions, kunwari sa laws, ganun. So if yun yung preamble, siguro uh, introductory siya ng kung ano yung rule mismo. Ayun lang. Uh, given I said no, wala din no idea, so yeah. I'm guessing since it's about the Philippine Constitution, it um it has related uh, laws that should be implemented in the Philippines and other political related maybe political-related topics? Uh, in my own words, uh, it's like an introduction uh, for the uh, 1987 Philippine Constitution. Uh, basically, uh, it encourages us as Filipinos to uh, exercise our rights and uh, to maybe uh, push for a better governance, uh, adhering to the democracy, and love for our nation. Okay. Well, uh, for me, uh, I think the message, or I believe that the message that the preamble is uh, stating is that for Filipinos to pledge uh, to the country that we should form a uh, more perfect union, um, establish uh, justice, ensure domestic tranquility, um, provide more, uh, pro- provide for the common defense and promote the general we- welfare. And also, 
it encourages Filipinos love and passion for the country. Kasi yung time na yun, seven years old pa ako, kaya hindi ko masyado alam parang mga salitang ganun. Okay, so it's to have the Filipino people have a basis in constructing the law and also in running the country. So, uh, kaya ganun. The 1987 Constitution is the is what you could say the foundation of the Philippine lawmaking body. Or, yeah. uh, I think it, it shows us and implies that the preamble is about the Philippine, the love for the country, the passion for the country, for our country, the Philippines. And it is significant and it gives us message in how we should uh, love and give and pre- patronize our country. Um, the preamble is uh, based on my understanding. Um, much like in every company, kailangan meron tayong pinaniniwalaan or meron tayong mission and vision. Kumaga parang yun yung um, sa bansa natin, especially sa constitution natin. Dahil hindi naman pwedeng uh, tumatakbo yung government natin without something na parang um, core nila, core values, I guess. Kasi yun, sa way the nakasaad naman din sa mismong preamble, um, which is um, parang self-explanatory na din kasi may part din ang history natin, ganyan, as as Filipinos. Yan, yeah, yung um, my idea about it is yeah, it is about the it is about the rights of the Filipino. Yan. Yeah overall kasi marami siyang selection which tinatakan yung mga kung ano-ano pa mga something but in a nutshell it's about the rights yeah, rights of the Filipino citizens A preamble is containing the introduction of the statement in the document wherein the objectives are provided that explain its purposes in which are legalized as the highest law of the land for its country. The preamble comes from the Latin word preambulus which means walking before wherein the introduction of the statement is explaining the purposes of an important document by authors of the constitutions. During the presidency of Marcos era, the preamble of 1973 Constitution of the Philippines was published, where the Filipino people have had a dark history. When time goes by, the preamble of the 1987 Philippine Constitution other words of the preamble were changed and new words contained to the general welfare of the Filipino. We, the sovereign Filipino people, important the aid of a mighty God in order to build a just and humane society and establish a government that shall embody our ideas and aspirations Promote the common good, conserve and develop our patrimony, and secure to ourselves and to our prosperity the blessings of independence and democracy under the rule of law and a regime of truth, justice, freedom, love, equality, and peace. Do ordain and promulgate this constitution. The preamble of the 1987 Philippine Constitution contains the source of the values, ideas, and aspirations by advocating of the Filipino people for a free nation and obtaining natural resources. It is forming a nation wherein the individuals have a different economic status that the rules of the government should be treated as the well-being of all the Filipino. No people or government shall be above the law based on the individual status as being honest for public officials. This preamble is for the best of the people to overcome society as one. The preamble telling about this constitution is for the Filipino and its country to represent the intention of the people who created and established the system of constitutions for the longest time and change it into the present time for the values of the nation.
in which we could have established the fair rights for our own good of services in the society that the government shall protect the properties or inheritance for the future generation through the years of establishment in any kind of laws and the government system still remains as officially proclaiming publicly of these constitutions. As of the 21st of uh, this month, I signed Proclamation Number 1081, facing the entire Philippines under martial law. This uh, proclamation was uh, to be implemented upon my clearance. And clearance was granted at uh, 9 o'clock in the evening of the 22nd last night. I have uh, proclaimed my law in accordance with the powers vested in the President by the Constitution of the Philippines. The uh, proclamation of my law is not a military takeover. I, as you will give the elected President of the Republic, 